Hi, it's Adrian. How are you doing today? And so I'm back and uh, with some new products. And yes, there are, are some uh, differences today. And um, so why don't we go ahead and get started with the makeup and then we'll get into the new stuff that I'm trying out. And so um, as far as primer, I use the e.l.f. Uh, Sun Touchables in Sunbeam. And uh, that's the glowy SPF. And then I did go ahead and use the True Match, and this one is by L'Oreal. And uh, this is a reformulated one in C2.5, so that's what I have on there. Um, I do have the NYX Fat Oil on, and this one is in Supermodel, but I think I'm going to put some more of that on. So, ooh. So, everything has been messy. I've been doing stuff tanner, as you can see. And um, just like with the fat oil, it's been a little bit messy. Um, but, like I said, we'll get there. And um, I did go ahead and pick up the e.l.f. Uh, contour and the blush. And the blush I got in Golden Hour. The contour is the light one. So, um, this is the blush, and I think that's really pretty. It's a lot like the, um, let's see, the uh, Charlotte Tilbury, the Peach Gasm. It looks a lot like that. And then over here um, is contour, and I went ahead and tried to blend it out. So that's kind of what it looks like. As far as what, um, let's see, I have on um, the eyes. I did go ahead and use the Heavy Petal by ColourPop. And I went ahead and used, uh, let's see, this one on um, as my base, this one on the inner corner, then uh, this one on the middle of the lid with some of the glitter on top of it, and then this really pretty plum on the outer corner as well um, to deepen it up. And I did use a little bit of the Enright. Uh, this is their gel, their waterproof waterproof gel eyeliner and so I went ahead and used this as my eyeliner today. This is how the look came out. So that's how that came out. Um, I did go ahead and use the uh, Sky High by Maybelline. This is one in Cosmic Black and the NYX Stick It, Stick it in Cool Lash Brown. So that's what I have on as far as brows and mascara. And then getting to what else I have going on today, and I did go ahead and pick up a self-tanner, and a new self-tanner that's brand new, that's over at Ulta now. And so um, with self-tanner and me, and it's always been the elephant in the room for me, because I'm usually so light, I'm almost albino. I mean, the joke is that if I didn't have freckles and moles, you can see me basically. So, um, and then I've tried all sorts of things like self-tanner and going to the tanning booths and stuff like that. And um, orange, yeah, orange happens. So um, this is new. This is from bon Bondi Sands and it's a sapphire for a natural, natural cool tone. So this is what it looks like. And like I said, it's new. It's over at Ulta. And it says that it's a self-tanner uh, for fair skin tones, um, and it's supposed to counteract the development of um, orange tones and uh, be right for people who have fair skin tones because we're not going to turn the same color. So it's very nice that they are making a self-tanner for me. I appreciate it. And... Um, do remember that I am filming in 4K, so I may have some difference here. Um, I did get a couple of marks here. These are from my bra, and I'm not sure why that happened, but, you know, it's nothing huge. My hands will tell you what the sapphire, it looks blue when it comes out, and my hands are still stained, um, but I did it last night, and so I'll just wash my hands a lot, and it'll come off. But yes, it does come out blue-green. So yeah, that's what it looks like. 
Um, tell me if you like it. Tell me if it looks weird in the comments. I would really appreciate that. Um, it's really easy to use. It's just like every other self-tanner. Um, and I shouldn't say it's easy to use. I mean, I use the uh, Ordinary, their 7% um, uh, toner. And so I put that like on my arms and on my legs and let it dry. Then I dry brushed, then I took a shower and I shaved during the shower. So hopefully I got as much dead skin off as I can. So using a self tanner isn't easy, but it's, you know, it's, and yeah, I wanted to try this one so bad when I saw, um, you know, that they had actually made something for <laughs> someone like me who has a naturally cool skin tone, a fair skin tone. And so, um, yeah, I think it, I, I'm liking it. It's the first day. It's going to take me some time to get used to it. But yeah, I'm thinking that I am going to go ahead and like it. And it didn't turn orange. Um, I had a slight, you know, gray blue cast, but that'll, that'll wear off in my hands. And I think that's the only place where I have that. At least it's the only place I've seen so far. And um, so tell me what you think. Tell me if you like it. And um, I think that's probably just about all I have for this video. So um, again, I, I'm trying out something new this year. And um, so far, I'm thinking it's working OK. And I'm kind of going like that, that it doesn't do anything weird. Um, and yeah, so that's my Sunday video. Finally, we are at spring, and thank you, and have a great day.